The circulatory system in cockroach consists of blood, heart, sinuses and ileary muscles. Blood Blood is white in color due to the absence of respiratory pigment hemoglobin. So, it does not help in the transport of respiratory gases but it transports all the nutrients to all the organs of the body and as well as it collects waste material from organs and supplies it to the excretory organs called malficient tubules. Sinuses The body cavity of cockroach is divided into three chambers or sinuses. The dorsal sinus is also called as the pericardial sinus. Heart is present in the pericardial sinus. The middle sinus consists of visceral organs hence is called as the perivisceral sinus and the ventral sinus surrounds the ventral nerve cord hence it is called as perineural sinus. Heart The heart of cockroach is present in pericardial sinus and it consists of 13 chambers. Blood flows from posterior chamber to the preceding chamber, from 13th chamber to the 12th chamber, 12th chamber to 11th chamber etc. They have lateral pores which open into pericardial sinus called as ostea. The first chamber opens into head sinus through an iota. Perivisceral sinus collects the blood from head sinus. Ellery muscles These ellery muscles are triangular shaped muscles and contraction and relaxation of these muscles are responsible for forcing the blood into heart. Circulation When the ellery muscles contract, blood flows from the body cavity that is the perivisceral and perineural sinuses into pericardial sinus. When the ellery muscles relax, blood flows from the pericardial sinus into the heart through pores called ostea. Peristaltic contractions of heart moves the blood from posterior chambers to anterior chamber. From the first chamber of the heart, blood moves through an iota into the head sinus. From the head sinus, blood flows into the body cavity, that is, into the perivisceral and perineural sinuses. From here, it goes into the pericardial sinus and the cycle is repeated. In cockroach, blood does not have hemoglobin and is colorless. It does not help in the transport of oxygen, but it helps in the distribution of nutrients to various organs and carries waste from the various organs to the excretory system that is the malficient tubules.